Now, all right. So, a uh, quick update on uh, the progress on the harness system, stone harness system for the F1 sheath. Uh, this was the first one. You gotta excuse my dyed hands again. That's what happens when a, a glove has a hole in it and you get dye in it while you got the glove on. Anyhow, this is the, the first harness system that I built, first design. You can see how those straps are a lot closer together on here than they are on this one, for instance. So I went to the wider, wider strap, still molly capable. And um, it just it's a lot more secure with the straps further apart. It's just more stable on a belt or molly. So now these are my new ones. So this is the, the system that I think I'm uh, ready to, to market. Um, you can see the difference between that one, which is the last one you saw, the two snaps. I was going to center them, but I thought, well... In for a penny, in for a pound. Now I've got um, the snaps on both sides of the sheath, on the outer sides of the sheath, which allows uh, for even more stability and uh, and uh, keeps that that flap to cover everything up a lot straighter. So I'm going to go with that. Um, not sure what else to say about it other than uh, I'm surprised by the interest I've had in these and uh, the orders that have been placed and the knives that are being sent out for me to design uh, sheets um, and a harness system after other people's knives. Um, just the response has been great so I'm very happy about that. But uh, I really like the sheet system. I think it's probably the the sleekest, most uh, secure, stable, uh, cleanest design out there that I've seen. I'm not uh, sh aware of anybody that's got something more solid and and uh, what I think would be more durable on the market. But of course, I'll just keep looking for uh, people that got stuff and uh, and keep my eyes out. But I think that's a really, really stable, solid design that's going to last for a long, long time. So, um, using my proprietary uh, finish on it, and um, I think what I'll probably do is I'll probably find a way to package uh, uh, finish and conditioner, some leather treatment for for every sheet that I send out, so that it, uh, it can be uh, treated every year or two, or whatever, keep the leather supple and. Uh, in good shape but uh, that's it that's the final design check the other videos to see the difference if you need to but uh, that's it I think that's gonna be uh, that's gonna be the one I'm gonna go to market with so this is getting sent out to a company that might be carrying a line of my sheets and uh, uh, we'll see what happens from there thanks for watching